Hi guys. I am going to do. Oh shit. Just tripped over my ring light. Alright. I am going to do a pour with you. I think I'm going. I don't know. I might do another swipe. I just did one. Uh, you might not have seen the video yet. But if I have it uploaded before this one, I will link it at the end screen. But uh, I'm just messing around with some paints that I have already had mixed up. They're different recipes, so if I remember the recipe, I'll tell you. If not, it's just kind of like little Mod Podge. But I'm going to start out with the base paint is uh, Artist Loft's Level 3 Heavy Body Titanium White, and that is mixed with Floetrol and water. That's what's on here. Um, I don't really have to worry about the sides because I have them taped off because I'm going to leave the sides natural wood. But I do want to have it like a um, have it go over just a little bit just so that it's a real even <laughs> a real even uh, layer on the top so it's not all lumpy to start with which I mean it would end up leveling itself out but it's part of the OCD I guess all right so I'm gonna do blues first I'm gonna get the bubbles out of my weight oh my god that's hotter than balls down here I don't know why it's usually freezing I don't know, maybe I have a fever. I don't know. Okay. So, the colors I'm going to be using, uh, Prussian Blue, which you guys know that this is my absolute favorite color of uh, regular paint. This is actually Grumbacher Prussian Blue. Uh, it's my favorite. So... If you do not have a Prussian blue acrylic paint in your arsenal of paints or in your, what I like to call, your paint hoard, <laughs> you need to add that. You're welcome. Um, okay. So I'm going to use Color Arts Dragon Fire. Gorgeous. And I'm going to use Color Arts Freesia. It's got a blue, purple, violet shift to it. Beautiful. I have Artist Love Thalo Blue out, but it's not really looking Thalo Bluey to me. I don't know. And then I have the Artist Love, no, 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 the Bling It Color Art Interference Blue. And then I'm probably going to put the Amsterdam white in there mixed with Floetrol. See if we can get some cells. I'm not sure if I'm going to add any gold to it. I would much rather add silver to it, but I don't have a good silver paint. Anyway, so here we go. Let's just do it. So, I think I'm going to go you guys, 
I don't know what I'm going to do. I always get stuck at this point when I don't have a full plan. Um, you know what? I'm just going to do some funky designs. We're just going to play. Right? See that blue? I know, it's fantastic. So on top of that, I'm going to use the interference blue, which is going to make it even more fantastic. Gorgeous, gorgeous. We'll put some of this in the middle too. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, let's do some of the freesia. I know I'm kind of being sloppy. It's okay. It's very late. I did another pour earlier and uploaded some videos, but uh, I want to get a couple of videos done. Sometimes I don't know how I'm going to feel during the day and I've really been feeling like crap lately. So, this is not level. I feel like I say that all the time. All right, so it is worth telling me, or telling you, this, this board I got from Lolly Vefe. Now when you're using like a wood cradle board, And you're doing like acrylic paint there's um, moisture in your paint right and so when you're done with your painting make sure that it is um, that you don't just have it drying you know with something in the middle you want to support your edges too because you don't want your wood to warp I learned that the hard way which I learned it in the very beginning of this venture, but apparently I forgot it. But, so I had some more paintings. So I ended up taking those paintings, flipping them upside down after they were dry. I sprayed some water on them. And then I put them down on the table and I put two heavy things of resin on them and they actually unworked. So if by some chance you do forget to do that for your wood boards, there is, there is hope. There's hope for you. All right, I do, let me see this phthalo blue. Let's see. That's kind of too bright, but I'm already there. So, I kind of got to go with it. Um, all right, guys, I think I'm going to swipe, I think. Or should I blow it out? I don't know. Do you have a sorry? I have a Payne's Gray from Color Art, which is a 
another one of my favorite colors. Um, so let's add some of that in here. All right. So I'm going to uh, add some of this white, and then I think I'm going to swipe. So I'm going to put some white here, I'm going to put some white all the way around. Let me see what swipe does. If I don't like it, then I'm probably just gonna like mouth blow it or something. People are sleeping, so I don't wanna do my hair dryer. would spin it but I'm not set up for <laughs> spin art just yet all right all right hang on Just, just piddling, piddling, is it piddling, diddling, whatever, I don't know what it is. Slow. So you want to go slow when you're. because you want it to really take hold. Use this other one and go this way and this way. This is just photo paper that I'm using. Okay, those would be the bigger swipes. You're going to hear my dogs. They're getting very anxious because um, it's 2 o'clock in the morning and they want to go to bed. Which, I mean, I can see their point, right? Luna, enough. Oh my gosh. You know what I want to try? I want to try... I'm gonna just blow some areas. Now this is the 
you hear people talking about the cell activator, right? This is actually the cell activator for like a bloom recipe. But I'm not really using the entire bloom recipe right now. So I can't really call it a bloom. So I am, however, going to take it and blow some of these areas. Let's see what happens. If I'm out of focus, I'm sorry. Give me one second. And then once you blow it, you got to give it some time to come back up before you move it because otherwise your paint is like stuck to your board, you know? So if you try to move it, the middle is going to sit there stuck and everything around it's going to move and it's not going to be pretty. Hang on. I have to get my... hoodie strings in take my glasses all right see where this dot is I'm gonna blow that out I'm gonna blow it that way hopefully I don't make a huge mess but it is fluid art so pretty much that's the name of the game. What the hell? Must have a ghost. Hang on. Okay, and then there's two spots here, but I kind of like that. Interference there. I don't want that to get totally blown off. Let's see what happens. Okay. All right, let's I'm gonna do something in the middle and then I think I'm gonna leave it alone. See what happens. Some really cool cells coming through. Really good lacing. This is kind of a boring part, so let's kind of make it not so boring. Take a little swiper. Trying to turn it so I don't mess with those other, didn't want to mess with them. I like this. I'm actually going to go right here. So I'm going to put the cell activator kind of like up here so that I can grab 
it. You don't want to disturb this little bloom thing. So I'm going to take it and go right through there. Okay, I think they're going to band together and knock my door down. So I'm going to put it right here. Bring it through. Uh-oh, where am I going with it? Bring it through. Come off right there. Did I mess it up? I may have. I don't want it to look like a swipe. I was going for one of those nonchalant, let's not look like a swipe swipes. So we'll just take this. And kind of go. Through it a little bit. Oops. Okay. You guys, I think I'm going to leave that one alone. Of course you're not. Of course you're not going to leave it alone. I'm going to take this up and bring it down. Barely touching it. Just scoot right across the paint. Just to add like, you know, a little bit more interest in it. All right, guys. Well, I think that one is Fanito. I'm going to torch the bubbles out of it. My torch is bringing up some stuff. So it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool when that happens. Um, so yes, so please hit the subscribe button. Um, there was a part I wanted to fix. Um, yes, finish the thought. Okay, please hit the subscribe button. Come join us on the Facebook page, United We Pour with Tammy and Lisa. I run that with Tammy Anderson. Uh, go check out some of her videos because they're pretty amazing. Um, so yeah. Go check out my good friend Tammy's videos. And uh, I'm going to take you in on a close-up here. And we will uh, see how this dries in the morning. All right, give me one second here. I'll get you off the thingy.
Okay. All right. I'm not super bright. Hang on. I'm going to turn my ring light down because sometimes it, you just can't see it. I keep it up high to film, but when I'm coming in for close-ups and stuff, and it sometimes messes with my autofocus, too. All right, so this is where we start. Very pretty. That's that freesia, the one that looks kind of blue, purple shift. That is this right here. Yeah, that's yummy. That is such a beautiful color. Look at that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, I tell you. I don't know if I gave you a close-up on the dragon fire. But while I got you, I might as well. This is a beautiful blue, and it's got blue, purple. I even see some green mica in there. Gorgeous. Those are from Color Art. Okay, back onto the finished piece. I get sidetracked with those beautiful colors. So yeah, guys, I really am digging this one. So let me go. Hang on. What the hell is going on with my phone? All right. Let me bring this closer so I can reach it. All right. So here it is. Tons and tons of reactions. The mixture between a swipe and me blowing it out with my mouth kind of was cool. See those? Aren't they pretty? Look at that. They're like cells inside of cells inside of cells. Rainbow bright. And look at this. Yeah. All right, so hopefully it dries good, and I will show you the dried result either at the end of this video or I'll wait till I have it resined. I'm not sure yet. So I hope you all have a fantastic day. I am going to take my dogs out and uh, put them to bed and put myself to bed. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you soon. Bye.